you hear that? That's something in the jungle. I'm not sure, it could be a monkey. Holy shit. I'm gonna get the out of here. Again, Jesus. Did you see that big monkey? <laughs> Holy I'm gonna check my heart rate. Whew. About 130. <laughs> Holy wasn't expecting that. That was crazy. I hope they're not following me. Oh man, that was almost monkey food. Whew. I think monkeys are vegetarian, thankfully. But oh. <laughs> that was funny. Well, it wasn't. Right now, I look at it. It is. <laughs> Oh man, alright. Let's keep going. I was expecting to hopefully see shit, lizards, snakes, spiders, but not possessed monkeys that get char charging out the bush and want to kill you. Oh. <laughs> alright. Still recovering from the monkey attack what's gonna happen next I swear I'm gonna come across a tribe of pygmies or something people that haven't seen any humans before in their lives are just gonna appear out of this jungle seriously I've been walking now an hour and a half but don't get me wrong I'd rather do this and be working just don't want to be eaten alive by monkeys or tread on a snake okay surely we must be getting close to the end but it don't look like it I can't even hear the ocean anymore it's way over there so I think I'm right in the middle of of the uh, the jungle but I do see something in the distance looks like another one of those rest stops maybe that we saw back there okay if that's the case we might still be on the right path or what I would almost assume was a path at one stage but probably due to lack of tourists on the island probably no one comes across here I might be the first person who's walked on this path for, for months maybe who knows Certainly those monkeys probably haven't seen too many humans before because they were not happy at all seeing me and I wasn't even a threat to them. I was just standing on the path looking into the into the jungle but they obviously didn't like the look of me and my bald head so the king, the big male I'm assuming, he was the one who came flying out of the jungle. Now this is very interesting. See no path at all, so I'm just gonna have to find my way, fight my way through this shit somehow. With flip flops. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, hang on, I think we're on a path again. Yep. Well, kind of path. Let's keep going. Please, 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 be close to the beach. I'm seriously going to just run to the water and jump in. Yeah, as I thought. Another one of them rest stops. Okay, let's keep going. This is getting a bit sketchy again. If I slip with the flip flops here, I'm going down there. That's about three, four meters. 
and this bloody plant is prickly. Oh, shit. Right. Oh. Oh. That could have been, that could have ended badly. Oh, it's just looking a bit more promising. More man-made structures. Should have brought my drone with me. I could have put it up in the sky. Oh shit, there's a lizard. That's two monitor lizards now. This is probably the area we're going to see more because we're back on this path, which means that's where they're going to sit out as they're cold blooded. They come out here and get the warmth in their body. So that's why you always seem to stumble across these kind of lizards on the major pathways. Not like the grassy ones back there, that wasn't really a path. Okay. We've got to be getting close. I'm really considering just to climb over those rocks and go straight in the water for a swim, but I think we can't be too far away, so I would prefer to swim on a proper sandy beach than, than rocks. And I don't even have my proper swimsuit with me, so, but it doesn't matter. I'm still gonna probably go in or find a place that serves beer and I guarantee the first beer I will not even taste it is going to go straight down in probably one gulp and then I'll enjoy the second beer actually I just realized something I cut the shit out of my arm I think when I was running away from the monkey I must have hit it on a tree or something caught it on a, on a branch nothing to uh, Serious, it's just a flesh wound, but hmm. Okay, so I think I've made it to the end of this journey through the jungle. Got the ocean here, some statue thing they've made. All right, it's definitely beer o'clock, way past beer o'clock. I've got to clean up this blood for my. Uh, Quick escape from the monkeys. Alright. I did read there was a big mosque on the on the island, but uh, here we are. Right, I'm just coming down here to wash my arm, get the blood off it. I think this is probably alright. It's not ideal, but anyway. Some of the locals keep staring at my arm. I just walk past them. <laughs> okay. So the mosque has just uh, awakened. Okay, so I survived the jungle. I'm in some, I think this is like a fishing fishing village or something. I'm not 100% sure where I am, but I've walked about 12,000 12, steps according to my watch. Don't know how many kilometers that is, but it's a lot. Um, clean up the arm from the, the wound. But the bad news is this area is very, very Malay and I just asked the guy in a, one of the little shots about getting a beer and he said nothing around here. So I'm gonna have to get a a water taxi I think down here by the jetty and go to Coral Bay where I was supposed to go originally and then hopefully I can get a freaking beer because if I don't get a beer in a minute I'm seriously going to die okay let's head for the uh, the water taxi now okay so I'm on the jetty I'm just gonna try and find one of these water taxis you can still hear the music from the mosque Hopefully I don't get uh, copyrighted on uh, YouTube from that. 
I think it's an original song, so it should be okay. So hopefully this is the right place for a water taxi. But everything I've done so far today, I've taken a wrong turn. So I, I bet you that jetty over there is a water taxi and this is the wrong one. I think that's a water taxi area, so let's, let's head over there. All right, finally found a taxi boat. Small money. 50 ringgit, can change. Up here? Over here? Okay. I just gotta get some change because these guys don't carry the uh, big money. So we just go over here and get some change. Okay, so I've got the change. Boat's coming. Okay, we're going. Hopefully, have a beer soon. No worries, mate. <laughs> so this beats walking through the jungle. Hopefully, we'll be there in a couple of minutes. These guys only go pretty quick, I think, in the boat. So, all right. See you later, jungle. minutes nice and easy beats the jungle okay yeah thanks mate yeah. awesome there goes my taxi this is coral bay all right Okay. This is the place to come snorkeling, I think. If you just want to snorkel off the beach. Look at this. I think I'll come back here with the fins and the, uh, the mask. Maybe tomorrow. I reckon you could just swim all around here, no problem. Okay, so there's the Hombak Dive Resort over here. Not sure if they've got beer, but I definitely know this place over there. Sen Senjay, I think it's called. Definitely has a beer. So, I'll try this one first, this is the closest one, and see if they've got anything uh, that resembles a beer, it tastes like a beer, and then I'll be one happy man. But it's been about three hours since I started the jungle trek. Okay, on Bugdai Resort, here we go. Please, please, please have a beer. Try down here. Okay, 
okay, the first bad news, the place wasn't even open. So, we'll head uh, down this way. I think Senjo's gonna be the, the place, I reckon. Okay, it's Senjo on, as we should say. So like the other beach, Long Beach, this one here, Coral Bay, again, basically one of the only people here in the whole place. Amazing. I have a whole beach to myself. Well, I just met two cool people from uh, Kuala Lumpur that are staying here as well, and they are uh, organising a fishing trip tomorrow. So they asked if I wanted to come along to uh, split the price. So yeah, I agreed. So he's going to call me later on and let me know timing and everything tomorrow. So it looks like I'm going out on a fishing trip. So that should be pretty cool. Hopefully we can catch some decent fish, you know, some marlin maybe, or sailfish, or even a GT would be good. I think there's plenty of them out there. So anyway, I'm at the Sinjay Cafe now. So let's hope this place has got beer. How are you, mate? Open? You got a cold beer? Oh, where can you get beer? No, it's closed. Yeah, he said open later. Long Beach only place. Okay. How do you? Get, what's the quickest way to Long Beach? Can you walk from here? Yeah, you can walk from here from Omba. Yeah. Okay. Last time I walked from because I'm staying Long Beach, uh -huh. I took the wrong turn and ended up in the fishing village. Oh no! Oh, crazy man! It was about a two-hour walk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I go this way, only ten minutes. believe it beer two cans oh, I've been waiting all day for this let's do it cheers oh hell that is damn good thank god I found a place where I can get beer about four places today, no luck. And believe it or not, just like everything else today, that's where I'm staying. This place is literally two minutes walk from where I'm staying. And I walked two hours in the jungle, another 40 minutes getting back. And I could have walked two minutes for beer. Unbelievable. So anyway, I'm gonna sit back here. Enjoy the view 